Hello, everybody! So, we have a special guest back by popular demand. Um, this is Rebecca. Hi, guys. Rebecca does have a YouTube channel. I'll link it down in the uh, description box below if you want to go check it out. Um, she has videos on there. She's not really making a lot of videos, but she still has some awesome videos that you can go check out. Two videos in particular that we are together with. So um, go check those out. I will link them in the description as well. Today, we are going to be testing Mexican candy. I went on Amazon and was like, mystery boxes, question mark. Cause like, I was just like, you know what? Let's just try, see what's available. I was, I, you know, I know I did Funko Pops. Um, I did a mystery box on Funko Pops. That was a lot of fun. Um, but uh, I wanted to try something else. See, just whatever mystery boxes they had. Um, and candy is a huge category on Amazon. So this is another box that came in. They came in like a little package here. I dumped all of them in this box. What we're gonna be doing is we're just gonna be reaching our hand inside the box, grabbing a piece of candy and trying it. Um, this is the kicker. Um, I don't really know what everything tastes like. I don't know the flavors. I have, re I have read the description of the um, post, the, the Amazon post. I'll link that down as well so y'all can go check it out, see if you wanna buy it. This bag of 32 pieces, yeah, 32 pieces was only like $11, which, not bad. Not bad. Um, I made sure I read the reviews before because I was like, I don't want to like get poisoned by like candy, <laughs> which is not fun. Um, that would not have been a good day. Um, everybody had positive reviews. Everything was like four, four and a half stars. So um, I felt comfortable trying it. But um, the kicker, and kicker being the keyword, is there's some spicy ones in here. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly had no idea what we were doing until I sat in this chair. Yeah, she walked up and she's like, what are we doing? I was like, we're trying Mexican candy. So, um, oh, goodness. It's okay, I like spicy. There's 32 pieces in here, but some of them are like duplicates. So like there's a couple of like um, little tiny pieces, but they put like multiples of those in here um, to like stuff the bag more. Um, but as far as I know, I don't know if there's chocolate. I'm not 100% sure. I'm pretty sure it's all like sweet, sweet, like, like, I, uh, like hard candy. So, um, and I'm pretty sure there's fruit, there's sour, there's spicy. Um, so do you want to go first? Do you want me to go first? I'll go first. <laughs> okay. Oh, what is that? Okay, that's the first item. Um, hold on. What? Pelon Pelorico? I don't know how to, I'm not, I can't say, I don't know how to open it either. I what? think you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> 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 Alright, whatever. It I'll looks try. like baby. Oh, wait, hold on. Are you trying it or am I trying it? <laughs> You're trying it, but you gotta get a real good whiff. Is there instructions? Dolce enchilada hoda ha. You don't have to like lick the whole thing. If you wanna just put your finger on there and try it just to see if you can like get a flavor of it. Why don't, why can't I lick the whole thing? Because I wanna try it after. <laughs> I don't want your whole tongue on there. Your face. <laughs> I'm processing. That's good. What does it taste like? Does it taste like apple? Because I think it, feels, it looks like apple. I don't, I can't. It kind of tastes like honey, but like with apples in it. I like it. You don't like it? It tastes bad. Bad? Oh. I thought it was good. <laughs> What's in it? Chili powder. I like that, so. You can't taste it. It's just like has a subtle. So about it. it's water, sugar, and chili powder. Like it's like a. Me. <laughs> We're done with that. Okay. ASAP. <clears throat> no more of that. Uh, okay. Oh, I want that one. I feel like I know this one is. 
So this is chewing gum. Violet flavored chewing gum. I didn't know violet was a flavor. I wonder if it's like similar to like lavender. You know how that similar to flavor? Possibly. But I know you can, they used to serve these at a lot of restaurants, but. I got distracted by your books. <laughs> There's a lot of books there. It tastes like a flower. Violet. It's like. It's like really floral. Strong. It kind of has like a minty ish flavor. Next! <laughs> Only, only oh, gosh, 30 left. <laughs> what would that look like? It's a pick. It looks like a pickle. I'm okay. scared. So there's another one. There's another pickle one. So I I knew there was going to be a couple. So we could um, try these together. Um, ingredients. There's chili in it. Um, yeah, this one has chili and it looks like, okay. I'll just say there's a pickle with a, 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 what's this hat called? A sombrero? So. It's a pickle with a sombrero, and it's Just called look how gross it looks Rico so Papino Super Altino. <laughs> That's, it's interesting looking. It really does look like a pickle, and it has chili in it. It doesn't it's smell a like a pickle. <laughs> interesting. I definitely can feel the. I just chili. got a kick of chili, but I don't taste like pickle. I don't maybe think maybe it's pickle. pickle's just like the the, the. It's not pickle. Maybe pickle's just like the the the, uh, the, the dude. Mascot. That one. <laughs> Whatever. That's what it's called. This tastes like sugar with chili. Yeah. I'll keep mine. Okay. <laughs> Well, no, I don't want to keep it. I changed oh. my mind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm next. This is Roccoletta. Four chili layers and gum center lollipop. Oh gosh. But this one looks like we only have, only have one of these. So, thanks. <laughs> it looks like it kind of melts in. This just looks spicy. It looks good. Like a spicy meatball. <laughs> 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 Look at that. All right, you ready? Uno, dos, tres. Oh. <laughs> something good. Poparindo. Extra hot and salted with real fruit. Um, okay, sugar, something pulp, corn syrup. Okay, that's ground chilies. Interesting looking. Well, that looks spicy. I don't think I'm gonna like this. One. <laughs> it like looks like a like a flattened slim gym. It smells like um a a fig. Have you ever smelled a fig? Uh huh. Oh, it does. It's very fruity. That's right with you. My brain doesn't know what's happening. Um. No, no. It's like really confusing. No. It's not bad, but like it's not that spicy. It's it just tastes like, like a little spicy bit of a sand. Tang. It's not that bad. Ma'am. <laughs> okay. Okay. I have a question for all of you people. If any of you have watched my videos, I have no idea what to post. I have literally like 
just been in a slump for months of I don't know what to post. Well, okay, so here's the thing. He's given me ideas, but, like, nothing has, like, sparked, like, an interest. You know what I mean? She went off to college. I did. So she went off to college and she was focusing on college. She plays sports at in college. So she plays volleyball. So mm -hmm. she was focusing on her first year of college. She was focusing on school. She was focusing on her sport, which is volleyball. So she had a lot on her mind. I understand you're not making videos. Mm -hmm. If anybody in the comment section can leave some ideas for Rebecca, go watch her, her some of her videos, grasp an idea of what she posts and what she makes. Um, she kind of makes a lot of lifestyle vlogs, clothing vlogs. She does a lot of college stuff. So go check her out. Go watch her videos. Um, and then come back and when you get done watching some of her videos, come leave a comment and let me know or let her know what, just Oops. some simple ideas of what she can make. Nothing extensive, people. Anyways, back to the video. So, back to your video. <laughs> Not about me. No, it's fine. <laughs> go watch her videos. And then come back and leave a comment on some just a quick ideas of what she can do. So, I, there's a big thing in here and I don't, I'm like moving it around. I don't want it. <laughs> I'm just like trying not to get it. Okay. This one is called Relorindos. Artificially flavored tamarind candy with chili pepper filling. Everything seems to have chili pepper filling. So what chili. is tamarind? I know it's a it's a root. It. Is it hard? Uh, like like a rock? Uh huh. <laughs> oh. Is it good? Oh my gosh! Does Josh like one of them? What is happening? <laughs> nope. Oh, spoke too soon. <laughs> uh. It's like. Can I try it? I don't want to bite it. It's like... How did you bite this? With oh. intensity. <laughs> it's like a Jolly Rancher, but not. It's like a Jolly Rancher. But has a little bit of a soapy flavor. It has aftertaste. And it gets spicy. Oh. Uh. Hold on, my brain is not on. That face. About time someone else had a face besides me. Oh, that's bad. Oh my gosh. Block the face. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's like a sauce. It's like, what's it called? Um, Twizzlers. But it looks like a Twizzler, like the okay, so strings of a Twizzler. Oh. Comes with this little liquid thing. Okay, so. Should we try the hot candy? Wait. Oh my gosh, it's spicy. Oh wait, no it's not. It's good. Are we supposed to pour this on there? I don't know. Should we pass on that? I'm gonna pass on it. Okay. It tastes good. It tastes like watermelon. It kind of tastes like a. It looks like one of those like friendship bracelets from a long, like when we were in high school. It sort of tastes like a watermelon sour patch kid with some chili powder dusted on it. Not bad. It's not that bad. My turn. I think I'm just gonna go with this one. The baby bottle pop. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> um, Lucas Moikas. Chamoy flavored lollipop with chili powder. I feel like there's a theme here. So I'm thinking the the mystery bag ha is like chili flavored Mexican candies. Like I don't That's think I don't think every Mexican candy has chili powder. In it. I just think it's this specific bag. Like I don't think that it all has that in it. So because I've tried Mexican candy before that did not have chili powder in it, and it was great. It's like fun dip. It's fun dip, <laughs> but the dip is just chili powder. I don't think it is. Let me just do it. Oh, thank you. <gasps> Spicy. No. Okay. Oh, wait. The candy's actually sweet. It actually tastes good. Ooh, that's spicy. No. 
No. No. More gum. Peppermint flavor, so it's just regular gum. Chili powder. Well, I just got like chili powder in the back of my throat from the last thing. Tastes like gum. Pretty good. Mm. But I want something that doesn't have chili powder in it. Guys, we're down to like the last like I think seven. Seven. Uh, ooh, this one has watermelon on it. I'm excited for that. Watermelon. Riba Nanditas. Interesting. I was like oh, really hoping for like a Jolly Rancher looking watermelon polypop. It just smells like old. I don't want to try this, y'all. Ready? Like, look at. Ooh. Yeah, it just looks bad. Like, mine has yellow all over it. Like, real chili powder. Ready? Uno, dos, tres. I didn't even get it all the way in my mouth. <coughs> it's in the trash. It's trash. It doesn't taste, it just tastes like salt. That's it. I'm not even going to attempt to try to get to the watermelon. Yeah, no, it's kind of on my list. That's it. Pepper covered artificially flavored strawberry gummy. Yummy. Smells like strawberry. I can't get it out. Mistakes for me. Describe that, but Ugh. no bueno. My I mean, it's not good, right? my taste oh, my taste buds are going through it. Pina colada. With no pina loco. Pina loco. Loca. Pineapple. It's pineapple and with chili. chili. It. Bottom line, straight uh, up. Yeah. I like it. This is so good. This is the best one so far. It like goes together. We're gonna be a minute. Okay, so we have, it looks like four left. Two lollipops, which we'll try together. We have one happy looking thing and then we have two different things of gum oh another lollipop chili pepper powder covered mango lollipop see now i know chili covered mango is a thing like people love chili covered mangoes like they sell them on the side of the road as far as like a a street food but like bruh it looks like a peep. And go. Oh. I don't. It <gasps> just is salty. It doesn't taste like chili powder. Yeah. But I'm not gonna. Not good. And plus, I hate mango. I know. Uh, I like it. It's very mangoey inside. I'm not gonna break my teeth. Well. Oh. Ugh. It doesn't really taste like mango to me. It tastes like garbage. Second that. Okay. So I'm just gonna take them out of the box. We have pulp arendo, which is hot and salted tamarind pulp candy. And then we have gum. This one is tutti fruity flavored gum. And then the other one is spearmint. So which one would you like? Uh, of course. I don't know what this is, I just grabbed one. Well, you're getting the, this one last, cause I'm getting this one. Okay. 
but it's not called Tootie Top, it's called Tootie Fruity. Delicious. Does it taste like bubble gum? Kind of. Like bubble gum flavor? Bubble gum? Slightly. Okay. But better. It's not for you. Mmm, it's good. Just kidding, it's not good. It's a lie. Actually, wait, hold on. Get it. It's not bad. It really isn't that bad. It, I wouldn't eat it. So, all in all, um, I would not recommend this. I'm glad I could do it for you so you don't have to. Okay. Because everything tastes the same. Everything tastes like salt. Everything tastes like chili powder. The fruit really didn't taste like the fruit they were saying it was supposed to taste like. Except for the lollipop. The pineapple lollipop was bomb. Um, I would say if you like chili powder, if you like salty fruit, go for it. If you're interested in that, try it. If not, we tried it for you so you don't have to. Candy though. On a scale of 1 to 10, freshness. Like, was the candy all melted? Was the candy all, like, did any of the candy taste stale? Mm -hmm. To me, it was a good, like, 8 out of 10. I'd say the same. Um, there was a couple things that were melted, but you can't determine if that was from them. And they gave me melted candy, or if that was just melted because it came in the box melted when they left it on the front porch. Um, variety of candy, a 2. Yeah. At least, if not a 1. Um because it's just all chili powder, salt, and tamarind. Um, they give you a lot of flavors underneath all of that, but majority of stuff is covered in chili powder. And the chili powder is basically salt yeah, with chili powder. It doesn't really taste like chili powder. It just basically tastes like a weird salt. I like the um, the little strings too. Yeah, those are The watermelon good. strings that look like a Twizzler. I like those too. Um, but they don't really taste like watermelon. They just taste like chili powder with like a powdery candy so um all in all if i had to rate this i'd give it probably a three out of a ten because it was fun but everything just tastes the same i will leave the in the description box the link to the amazon post if you want to go buy this for yourself if you want to try this in a video or if you just want to buy it to try all the candies with your kids or with yourself you do you um it's not cheap it was like eleven dollars um, so I understand why. Um, but that's all I have for you today. Thank you, Rebecca, for being here. Okay. Again, go watch her videos. Thanks for asking me to come back. Make her go post some more. And thank you so much for being here. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. As always, make sure you hit the notification bell so you can notify when I upload videos. And then thank you so much for being here. And let's go to Disney.